Why is giant grouper is scary? This part of the ocean doesn't belong to you. Giant groupers are considered scary by some people due to their size and appearance. They can grow up to 8 feet long and weigh over 800 pounds, making them one of the largest reef fish in the world. Close to these shadows, you may not. Their massive size alone can be intimidating. In addition, giant groupers have a large mouth filled with sharp teeth, which they use to catch their prey. It's of up to 360 kilograms and lengths of almost two and a half meters. They are also known to be ambush predators, hiding in crevices and waiting for their prey to come close before striking. This behavior, combined with their size and teeth, can make them seem like a formidable and intimidating predator. It's also worth noting that giant groupers are not usually aggressive towards humans and attacks on people are rare. However, they are sometimes caught by fishermen, which can cause them to become stressed and agitated leading to potentially dangerous situations for those around them. Giant groupers are known to be solitary and territorial, which means they can become aggressive towards other fish and even divers who invade their space. They have been known to attack divers who get to close, especially during the breeding season when they are particularly territorial and aggressive but when you've been down deep, you need to ascend slowly and give your tissue time to let the gas out naturally. When your body undergoes a sudden shift in pressure, it could give you a stroke or even paralyze you on the spot. But Giant groupers have a unique hunting technique where they use their large mouths to create a vacuum, sucking in their prey hole. This technique can make them seem like a monster fish, and their large mouth filled with sharp teeth can be particularly intimidating. While giant groupers are not typically dangerous to humans, they are still powerful creatures that can cause injury if mishandled. They have been known to drag fishermen into the water or break fishing lines with their strength. In some cultures, giant groupers are considered a delicacy and are therefore heavily fished. This has led to a decline in their populations in some areas, and the fact that they are becoming rarer and harder to find may only add to their mystique and perceived scariness. Overall, while giant groupers may not be inherently scary, their large size, unique hunting technique, territorial nature, and potential for harm can make them seem intimidating to some people. It is extremely rare for a human to be eaten by a grouper. Groupers are large fish that are generally not aggressive towards humans. However, there have been rare incidents where groupers have attacked and bitten humans, usually when the fish have been provoked or feel threatened. In some cases, fishermen or divers have been bitten by groupers while attempting to catch or handle them. In other cases, swimmers or snorkelers have been bitten while swimming near reefs where groupers live. While these incidents can be serious and require medical attention, it is highly unlikely that a grouper would actually eat a human. Groupers are carnivorous fish that primarily eat other fish, crustaceans, and cephalopods. They do not have the physical ability to consume an entire human. It is important to always respect marine wildlife and avoid provoking or approaching wild animals, including groupers. 
Goliath Grouper. And if you wander too close to these shadows, you may not come back out. So, what would happen if this giant devoured you? This is What If, and here's what would happen. If you are swimming or diving in areas where groupers are present, it is recommended to maintain a safe distance and avoid any interactions that could potentially harm the fish or yourself. Thank you for watching. If you like this videos, please like and subscribe. My channel see you to my next videos.